What's up guys on a Sunday afternoon, a little news story in from PayPal today. And I gotta do this, everyone who watches my videos will know why I have to do this. But today, PayPal CEO, after all the big changes, announced that they are not interested in Bitcoin yet, as of now, that's not to say it'll never happen, but like I said, they are not interested in Bitcoin. And they filed a patent for what looks like a trademark name or a website name or some kind of domain name or, or currency name, whatever they trademarked um, that included several items uh, about like PayPal Bitcoin or PayPal crypto or PayPal crypt or whatever the domain is that they registered. Um, they did it 18 months ago, guys. 18 months ago, Bitcoin price was like a thousand bucks. This is before it ever took off or went into, you know, the hype mode of the boiler room pump and dump stuff. But uh, PayPal filed that patent because of the maybe. No one knew anything about crypto. You know, the, the mass majority of people didn't know anything about Bitcoin or crypto or any of that stuff. 18 to 24 months ago, it was unheard of. It was just brand new. I mean, it wasn't actually brand new, but to the real world, it was brand new. So PayPal did it kind of like as a just in case, like, you know, if this is to become legitimate, then we need to have our trademark covered. And that was a good idea. I don't ever doubt somebody for jumping on something that might be becoming something, but I can tell you that PayPal realized what it was along with a lot of other places. Hence the reason why PayPal doesn't have a little drop down menu that says pay us with your Bic Bitcoin or your cryptocurrency or whatever and they never ever ever will mark my words it will not happen. They're not interested and they're not going to become interested in the next 18 months because some miracle of crypto happens. Not happening. But for all my haters that think they know everything, especially my 17 year old PhD stock market crypto investor gurus, it's not happening. No cryptocurrency Bitcoin going on PayPal anytime soon or well ever, let's just clear that up, ever. Will they be used through another company that comes on a PayPal as like a third party? Eh, maybe but I can promise you that PayPal will never directly have that relationship. Mark my words, mark this date. Let's go to the website. Let me just show you guys. That way it's just not me talking, it's me actually showing you straight from the words of the CEO of PayPal. Let's take a look. Okay, so here we go on the street. Uh, Jim Cramer, obviously you guys probably know him from his online and his TV shows, Jim Cramer, uh, the investor shows. PayPal CEO says Bitcoin unsuitable, but here's what he's really excited about. And Bitcoin is too volatile to serve as a real currency. Quote, PayPal CEO Dan Shulman, uh, which he was doing an interview with The Street uh, by Kenzie Grant. And PayPal Holdings Incorporated is a leader in fintech, but not betting the ranch on Bitcoin just yet. CEO Dan Shulman told The Street that his company is all about innovation, but not just surrounding Bitcoin. Um, but don't look for crypto exchange on PayPal's Venmo anytime soon, really, or ever. I mean, this was kind of his way of saying, yeah, we're not doing it now, but this is kind of his way of, you know, pushing it aside so people will stop asking him because it's been a constant question. This was originally from the end of January of this year, so it was about a month and a half ago, but they rehashed the story, so I am putting it out there. I kind of knew about this before that PayPal wasn't going to accept it. A lot of you guys were tweeting me and sending me stuff about, oh, look, PayPal's going to take crypto, and I said in the video, no, they're not, no, they're not, no, they're not. Here you go, straight from the CEO's mouth. And, um, you know, he's he's quoting the part where, you know, crypto and Bitcoin can bounce up and down 15, 20 percent over a couple of weeks. And that could be the difference between profit and losing money and no money transfer, money transaction company like PayPal or Venmo or anything like that is ever going to accept something that just has no set value and no way to like determine what it's worth. And it's wholly solely based on what people perceive it to be. In other words, pumping and dumping it and hyping it up. And no company is going to bet their company and their profits based on some dozen big social media people all of a sudden blasting social media and pushing the price up and then all of a sudden selling all their things. It's just not going to happen. So um, Shulman was saying that it's not, you know, viable now, but, you know, read between the lines. He's saying that unless something huge changes, it's not going to be viable for PayPal ever. Bank on it. Bookmark this video. Save it. Save your comments. Save your crap troll comments. Just save this for later for when PayPal never takes crypto. And in two years, you can come back and post it again. And you can just say that I told you so.
PayPal will not accept crypto or Bitcoin unless something humongously drastic changes and people stop hyping it up and pumping it and all that crap. Um, in the meantime, no crypto or Bitcoin for PayPal. So go ahead and get your panties out of a bunch, calm down and go back to paying with the good old American dollar. Sorry if I offended every, anyone, especially and not to forget my 17 year old stock market expert investors. I don't want to leave you guys out. So have a wonderful night, but you know I couldn't resist making this video. Love everyone, and I'll be back to usual programming tomorrow.